Nick Yorkies outside the bowling, West Ham Fan TV, triple trouble here. What do you think of that game, boys? Felt, felt a bit boring, to be fair. <laughs> it wasn't a lot, not a lot of atmosphere. Yeah, I fell asleep in it. You know, <laughs> I don't think it was the worst we've played this season, but there was no, there was no tempo. No, no. It wasn't great. No, I thought it was crap first half. It was completely boring. Um, I thought Jelovic up from on his own, he was absolutely pathetic first mm. half. Wasn't doing anything. Um, Second half, I thought he was a little bit better, he was working hard, but as soon as Carroll came on, set him up set him up for that goal, I thought he finished it really well, uh, it was a great first goal. So, I went down early for the first half, because yeah. I was falling asleep, and I didn't think we asked enough questions of him, to be honest, um, and you just, you know, you pointed out Yellow Votes weren't doing a lot, I don't think he had a lot of food off, I don't think they put enough into him, I didn't, you know, considering he's sort of playing in front of Carroll, if you like. It wasn't it, a very potent attack, was it? No, I don't think it was. No, no, no. I don't think we, we really put enough. We didn't have enough urgency for me. Anyway, uh, bear in mind, Wolves didn't have a lot of ambition to get forward. No. Yeah. You know, you know what they were going for. So that's fair enough. But um, I don't yeah. think Yelovic really, you know, it, as much as you can say he didn't do a lot, yeah. I don't think he had a lot of food off. And well, Jenkinson was. Jenkinson, sorry. Jenkinson, I don't think really got. He didn't, he, you know, I was sitting right on that 18 yard line. And I didn't think he really put himself up for a lot of balls. No, he, he weren't really looking to... Didn't look up for it, did he? He didn't look up for it at all, you know, he weren't really looking... Is he dreaming about going back to Arsenal? Yeah. Is he thinking, oh, you know, I'm yeah. not getting inside here? Because yeah. yeah. what he thinks right now is just because he's just signed a four-year yeah. deal with, it with Arsenal and now getting however many grand a week he's getting, you know, he, he's safe, isn't he? Yeah. You know, he's all fine. Arsenal Wenger wants him to stay. Well, if Arsenal Wenger keeps on looking at him doing things like that, he won't want no, him to no, stay. exactly. You know, in, to I, th start I think, the impression, I think you know? if he wants his dream to come true, to be Arsenal, you know, he needs to he needs to step up his game yeah. big time. Any thoughts on that? Um, I thought Jenkinson was alright. Uh, I don't think he was great. Uh, his crossing is poor. His crossing, he really needs to work on his crossing. Um, he needs to get a leaf out of uh, Cresswell's book because uh, yeah. Cresswell is quality when he crosses it. You know, he's always going to get it on Andy Carroll's head. Yeah. Um, I think that's one of the reasons why Yelovich was was so poor today because he wasn't getting the ball enough. Service, no. he's, he's not he's not one of them strikers who can just run down the wing. What, what do we think about Yelovich? You got a cracking winner. We know we got a cracking winner, but. I was saying after 85 minutes, he's got to be finished here. We've got to, you know, we've got to be looking to ship him out because he didn't look good at all, did he? Even, even though he didn't have any service, he just offers not a lot. He's the type of guy who will put 100% effort, but nothing will come out of the yeah. game. Like Swansea away, he, he put literally 100%, but nothing was working for him. He was useless, you know. And I don't, and I don't think it's going to happen for him. I think it's one of them cases where the body's, the mind's willing, but the body won't let him do that. No, I agree with that. Yeah. 100. percent I think he's, he's, he was Committed. pretty, he was pretty good when he was playing for Everton, yeah. you know, and uh, even for Hull he'd done a little bit, but I, I don't think he's good enough for this level. Um, I don't. So we're in the air. That's the important thing. Yeah. We, we, you know, we, we did show some spirit out there today. Considering it's such a poor game, considering they made it difficult for us, we still got in the air. We're in the fourth round. Who do we want in the fourth round? A nice small tie or a big London derby or something? You know what? A tie's a tie, you know. I'll take anyone. I'd, I'd like a good MK Dons away, to be fair. Yeah. <laughs> That's you know, a random word, isn't it? MK Dons away. You know, you're guaranteed 8,000 away fans. You yeah. know? A good away day, I, I love that, you know. I'm not bothered, to be honest, because no. I think Billich is taking this quite seriously. Yeah. Yeah. I think play a big team, he'll put all the big boys out, and then I think he'll play a little team. I think he'll still put on a good, good side like he did today. I personally would like a bigger team because I think we apply ourselves a bit more. I think we uh, are a bit sharper to the ball. I think we're a bit more focused when we play a bigger team. Then, no disrespect to Wolves, but I think we're a bit more at it when we're playing a bit a high level side. Come out the camera, mate. Please hit. Come out the camera. Yeah. When we're playing a high level side, I think we will be a bit more at it myself. Yeah. So to yeah. to be fair, you know, it's good to say you're going to have a someone you expect to beat on paper. I think we play a bit better when we're, yeah. ex, you know, we're. Well, maybe not the underdog, but because I don't think we're, anyone's an underdog. No. And the way the league's going, if you put it, you know, to to how the league is this season, I think we've got as good a chance as anybody. I think over the years we've slipped over too many banana skins to, exactly. yeah, yeah, exactly. You yeah. know, it would be typical West Ham, wouldn't it, to go and draw someone you expect to go and beat on paper. I think if we bring someone in front of us who yeah, maybe we're on a similar level or maybe on paper should be beating us, I think we step up a little step bit. Up a bit. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. It's always been the way with us. Yeah. One more question. Before before we go, because it is pissing down and we are all getting all soaking wet, um, Billich, 
has come out today in the, in the, in the internet and all, on the press conference or whatever and said this is in, more important than the Champions League. Is that refreshing or do you think he's, he's right a bit of a fault? He's right though. He's right. Yeah. Because, because look at the team we've got. We, we, can't, we can't handle teams like Bayern Munich. Let's be honest. <laughs> Let's be honest. <laughs> we're not, we're not, I, you know, I don't think we're even good enough to go past the group stages. You no, know. I, I, I think right what, what he was being asked is more about you know, the money that comes with it, you know, the, you know, the prestige that's meant to come with it. And he's like, no. This is important when yeah, you win a cup. Is, you know? yeah. yeah, I think you've got to be realistic to what your goals are. You know, when he took the job, it was stay up. And then because we've got the points we've got on the board, there's no longer a fear, in my opinion, of, of going down that route. So he's got to readjust his targets. And yeah. the FA Cup is a realistic target for us, in my opinion. And we've, got, we've never had a better chance. You know, last time we won the FA Cup, I think, it, correct me if I'm wrong, was we done a double over Liverpool. So there's a stat for you to look at, but I'm sure the last time we won it was when we done a little double, double was the time before oh. we won in eight years. Yeah. Oh well, who cares anyway? I've never been a statistician, but yeah, you know, you know, for, in my opinion, we've got the team. Why do we stay injury free? We've got a good chance yeah. this year, in my opinion. Brilliant. Anyway, quick one on Village. Um, Important. Yeah, I, th I think I think he's he's great because he's taking it seriously. I don't think I don't think we're taking it seriously in other like with other managers. Honestly, I think I think we've got a good chance this year. Cut. Brilliant. <laughs> anyway, thanks for joining us, boys. Thanks a lot. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.